Today is June 11, 1996. Jacqueline School Project. Jacqueline's making some ice. Gonna show us how to the recipe for making ice. Did someone just fluff? <laughs> <laughs> Jacqueline's gonna. It's camera having nachos. <laughs> Jacqueline's gonna tell us how late. Mark is just going to <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, Let's, let's re reenact that, Jack, for the camera. Go ahead. Hello. Hi. How late is Parker's Club? I, I mean, open. All right. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Anytime you're ready, it's filming so we can all just. This is Jackie Plisa, and I'm going to show you how to make scones today. Before you preheat the oven and do oven grid, you must always remember to wash your hands. So I'm going to wash my hands right now. There's no toilet papers. Take that and take the uh, napkin. Okay, I've set it the uh, oven to 425, and now I have already mixed the dry ingredients, and these ingredients are three cups of white flour, two teaspoons of salt, and two teaspoons of soda. So now I'm going to add the milk, and that calls for one third cup of milk. Okay. Now I gotta uh, get that set. Now, so now I am right now adding the milk to the dough and trying to get it into a ball so I can uh, knead it five or six times. Some people prefer to use their hands. I don't know. What's the name of your recipe? Oh, by the way, this is from the Italian uh, recipe from, for Italian scones. That was Do those, Irish. Do those taste like? <laughs> <laughs> those taste like scones from Ireland too? <laughs> <laughs> Roll it into a circle for the cutting of the stone. Actually, we're supposed to cut some. 
So should I say that it's in? I've you cut you tear half of it off. Oh, actually, it says okay. Divide dough into balls. One ball. I've divided the dough in half, and each scone makes four cones. Four scones. Time. <laughs> No, uh, mostly the dough. Okay. Okay, I've separated the dough in half, and each ball is most is eight. So we use. Okay. So we use two. What you're supposed to do with one of them is make it about five inches. Make it into a five inch little ball round plate here. And the thickness is supposed to be towards the middle, so it's supposed to be kind of thinny out here. I guesstimate on five inches around there. So what do we do now? Now we cut the dome. Just a minute, go ahead. Now we cut the dome in four wedges and lay it on an ungreased baking pan and let it rest for 10 minutes. Now they are going to rest for 10 minutes. Okay, go ahead. That 10 minutes. That 10 minutes went by fast, didn't it? Now it's time to put them in the oven for 10 to 12 minutes or until lightly golden brown. So here they go. Set the timer. Go ahead. Waiting for the timer. Oh, there's a timer, so that must mean that they're ready. Open it up here. Mm -hmm. Do these look good? Those look pretty good, Jacqueline. <laughs> Can your daddy have one? Look up at her back. These can be 
served with batter or fruit preserves. And let me try one here. Mm. Very good. How are your cones? <laughs> <laughs> so, if you ever feel like, if you ever have a hankering for some Italian cones, <laughs> come, come to Jackie, please. She'll make you some. And if you need to wash okay. your hands, we can have some toilet paper for you to try. <laughs> why don't you, you, you finish up and just say what they are and say that? So that's how, so that's how you make it. Scones from Ireland. Irish soda scones. So now I've demonstrated how to make Irish soda scones. And until next time, this is Jackie Plisa. Good eating. And and next week you're gonna teach them how to toast bread. <laughs> yeah.